Thomas Weather. The Rich Thomas Weather Network, brought to you by these fine sponsors. Hear Rich's forecast hourly on these Blue Water Broadcasting radio stations. Hey, good morning, everybody, on this Wednesday morning. It's the 14th day of July. Time as I make this is 3.27 a.m. Radar, over the last several days, as you probably know, has been very busy. There's been lots of showers and thunderstorms around, and, of course, that has been the theme of this summer. More, uh, more showers than normal, more clouds than normal. T today, though... I think as a ridge of high pressure builds about four miles above us, today the storms will thin out in number. You could still get an inch of rain at your house, but there won't be many storms to go around, as you'll see in a moment. I've updated the rain chances through the weekend for here and the Gulf Coast beaches. Let's get into the details. Today is the definition of a routine summer day in the state of Alabama. It's going to be hot and humid, uh, and there'll be a sprinkling of showers and storms on the radar, but not many to go around. Uh, very typical with the trough of low pressure that was causing so many showers now gone, the ridge of high pressure building, and that means storms will be few and far between. Now, don't get me wrong. You could still get a very heavy downpour at your house, but look at the separation on the storms on future radar. Here's a snapshot at 4 o'clock in the afternoon. Not nearly as many as we've seen over the last few days. And I think the big story will be heat and humidity. We'll be in the low to mid-90s and the heat index easily near or above 100 in many in cities and towns this afternoon. So I'll put the high temperature around 93 and the rain chances parked at roughly 30% today. Tonight's low 73 and I think the winds will be light today. Tomorrow, again, uh, uh, we'll be in the low to mid 90s with just a sprinkling of showers and storms here and there. I think the rain chances are you know, only in the 30 to 40 percent range for the next few days, right on through the upcoming weekend. And uh, even on Saturday, uh, a pretty routine forecast. Now, I think maybe perhaps later in the weekend by Sunday, we'll take the rain chances up just a hair, perhaps. But uh, I think it's the first of next week when the rain chances will start to get better. And that's because another trough of low pressure developing in the upper atmosphere. Um, and that's been the theme of the summer will make storms more numerous and Plus, we'll have a frontal system in the Tennessee Valley region, and we'll be just south of that front. So we'll take the rain chances up higher on Monday, maybe a 50-50 chance of showers and thunderstorms. And I think the better rain chances could hang around on Tuesday as well. Uh, still, not many changes even early next week, with the high temperature in the low to mid-90s right on through uh, Sunday. And I think uh, the rain chances are in the 30 to 40 percent range each day, a little bit higher as we get towards Monday. And we'll keep the better rain chances around on Tuesday as well. Lows at night will be in the lower 70s right on through the upcoming weekend. Beach forecast for the beaches from Gulf Shores to Panama City. Uh, not bad on the rain chances this weekend. Better than the last few weeks, right? 30 to 40% chance right on through the weekend with highs in the middle 80s. Gulf water temperature now at a season high of 84. And watch the flags on the beach, okay? Uh, for today, right on through Friday night, um, yellow flags flying on the Alabama and most of the Florida beaches through Destiny but a high-risk red flags around the Panama City area. So take it easy out there. It's been a tough year for uh, rip current deaths. Area to watch out there in the North Atlantic, yeah, not a big deal at all. Way out there, uh, a lonely, uh, one lonely X, 10% chance of development. Hey, just make a note, tomorrow night will be a very good space station flyover. In fact, the 3.6 brightness is about as good as it gets right around 8.30 tomorrow night. And I'll tell you what, I'll remind you again tomorrow, but that's going to be a good one. I think uh, the pools and the lake and the beach will be a very popular place this weekend with the uh, heat and humidity and temperatures back in the low to mid 90s, which is more typical of what we normally expect this time of the year in this part of the world. Live on the radio this morning from 6 to 9 on News Talk 93.1. Live on CBS 8 and ABC 32, their morning program is called Alabama Rising. There will be another video for you. The official posting time is 4.45 a.m., but very frequently it comes out a little earlier than that. And your forecast whenever you want it across the dial on eight radio stations. Boom, 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 boom on the Blue Water family of stations. All right. It's clear as a bell out here this morning and uh, not too bad on the humidity. We'll uh, see you later. I'll uh, have another video in the morning.